All right. Um, okay, I'm just making sure the music's playing because the bar wasn't moving for a second. Um, welcome back to some more Animal Crossing New Leaf. It's been a week. Over a week. Something like that. I can't remember. All I know, I've been at hard work. You should see the one video that pretty much shows it. But I hope you all had a great Mother's Day. In game, it's Mother's Day. So I hope you all had a good Mother's Day since it should be Monday today. So, the day after Mother's Day. So, yeah, let's uh, check out Mother's Day real quick. Mother's Day pretty much is... Uh... Oh, I got a lot of cards that are like trash. <laughs> I'm glad that was a that was, that's a weird card. Just point that out. <laughs> what? Are you letting me know that you're getting in the shower or something? <laughs> um Yeah, there's something that I have not <laughs> Um, there's something that I have not shown on this, and as you can tell, you're not going to be able to see it still, but, uh, yeah, if you, uh, if you have a max mailbox, pretty much the mailbox shakes. So, won't be seeing that, but, yeah. Okay, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, and that. That and that and that and that and then move the rest of these. Like, yeah, this is what happens when you miss a week's worth of uh, recordings. <laughs> That's not funny since you all know it hasn't been a week in the game. Okay. And I can finally stop hearing that beeping noise. And look at my gold stuff. <laughs> okay. Ooh, HHA? Ooh, I, I, I got something in the, from the HHA? Happy Home Academy sent me something? And they sent me something there, too? What did they send me? Also, if you notice, it's like Christmas outside my house and everywhere in the town. If you didn't see the old the videos with short parts and or short clips and all that, uh, yeah, I hit a lot of balloons. So I wonder if I even have an entire balloon set. For all I know. <laughs> well, you know what. I'm gonna have to put these back in the envelopes because this is what you get for uh, Mother Mother's Day, by the way, a red carnation. So, yeah, that's that's Mother's Day for you. No wait, that's Father's Day. Okay, never mind, never mind. It's the pink one that you get a uh, that you get a carnation for. Okay, so let me put these back. Why am I putting the stuff everywhere? Because, uh... First and foremost. Wow, that looks cool. Wow, that looks cool, too. Okay. Putting it all back because I want to show you all something real quick before I do a quick uh, little moment for you all. A good few minutes for me. Yeah, here's my collection of stuff. Ooh, nice fish. And I made my room look so cool. My upstairs, like, not cool, but like... You get scorpion on the left side and the spider on the right side. And if I had to listen to this crap... Where's the other one? If I had to listen to that one, now, something that I like to listen to would be, uh, was it this one? No. That one reminds me of a certain anime. 
I already said it was Higurashi Nonako Korani, <laughs> I think, in another video. But, yeah, this is the sa this is the cicada that, uh, or the Higurashi that uh, is sounded whenever in the anime. So, yeah, that's why I like that one. <laughs> okay, and yeah, here's uh, snails you can get on the island on rainy days very easily. Just to let you all know. Otherwise, it's best to get them on uh, between this month and next month in the rain. On shrubs. You gotta have a shrub. Which, you don't get shrubs until... <laughs> um, pretty much uh, can only get shrubs for a little while on the island when you start the game. So, bear that in mind. Um, also, I'm keeping one of these in my room. The firefly. I, I like fireflies. Get rid of that noise, though. Thank God for that. <laughs> And then downstairs we got uh let's see this entire room filled god that noise it's another annoying sound oh by the way um if you all just want me to make a video of me going through every single bug and then every single fish for another video and then every single uh, sea creature, please post down in the comments because there's like a lot of them. I don't know why, but I like that sea creature for some reason. And then, I still gotta like the turtle. Um, otherwise, uh, Let's bugs. You two were a pain. You two. Okay, enough screwing around with that. Got a couple other rooms to show you. Like, look at how filled up this room is. And then... We got this room up here, which you've seen mostly all of it filled up. There's that noise. Um, yeah, I got a lot of silver slingshots. <laughs> a very lot. Way too many. <laughs> so many freaking slingshots. And then, um, finally... We'll go in here real quick. And... Yeah, this was the last fish I caught. Firefly was the last bug I caught. And then the last deep sea thing I caught was, I think... Yeah, it was this guy, actually. <laughs> so, yeah, with that, um, I will be right back in a second as I deliver everything to the museum because I just wanted to show you how filled up my house has been trying to collect all these bugs and fish and sea creatures. <sighs> <sighs> Never again. <laughs> okay. Let me just go back in one more time and I noticed as that ch as that chime came in um the uh outside lights for my house went on, like the two right here and right here. So that's just a little heads up, I guess, about that. So I pretty much got everything squared, but I want to show you all something too. I got, I know I got one painting. I got this painting, but... I don't remember this painting right here. But, oh, whatever. Also, 
that, and that. My house is so good. I got a gold and a silver uh, trophy. Just, just showing that off. Okay, so let's take the paintings with us. Let's take the cricket. The big huge fish that's taking up a lot of stuff. I have no idea who sent that or if it's a special... Uh, special... Mail delivered. Like, you know, like the Halloween mask sort of thing. Let's take that with us. And, uh... That bug is a repeat bug, just to let you know. I like the leaf bug. Sue me. I also... Oh, and I forgot about that, too. Um... Let's see. None of those. I already took the... The little tiny bug that was right here, and then the... Firefly I already took, as well. Okay, so... Let's just take that and be on our way. Now, I want to see what happens, what his reaction is, because I don't know if I even got all the bugs, like, for the museum. I might have accidentally sold one or two, because, uh, there were a few flowers that weren't filled up, but that could be just decoration, too, for all I know. So, yeah. And I'm saying a couple, not, not, um just one because I got a cricket left and it's not a cricket that goes on a flower it's like a mantis or whatever I thought it was the white one at first but then I looked in the white ones actually in the first room so yeah okay I'm gonna give you one thing at a time now man so first take this fish. That fish took forever to get. Yeah, put it in your museum, man. Okay. Now, what happens if I give you this? Will you say something like, Oh my god, you took caught all the fish? Yeah, that fish is cool, isn't it? Yeah, put it away. No? Okay. So now, what happens if I give you... That? Okay. Okay. Reaction? Yeah! <laughs> what? You caught all the fish of the sea? Yeah. It's called chicken of the sea for a reason. That... Doesn't make any sense, but whatever. Thanks for the applause, man. Thanks, that took over a week to do, but I finally got it done. Uh. And then he goes, he doesn't go back into the menu. <laughs> okay, now I got a bug for you. Oh, come on! I know he hates bugs. Even though he's an owl, and owls, I think, eat crickets. I know they eat my mice. Must be thinking of an... I'm probably just thinking of birds in general. <laughs> okay. Put it in your pocket, and then make it an exclamation. Yeah, I caught all the bugs, too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now I got all these. Are any of them fakes? That's the question. We'll see. I know a lot. Of, well, most of them, or two of them, should be real, but I don't know if one of them was fake. We'll see. Oh, they were all real. Wow. Okay. Cool. Cool. I got more paintings, and I really need to get that painting collection done. Because I want to see what the item is from Blathers, if it's a museum model, or if it's something else, or what. 
Yeah, you. I know you. If both of his arms are like that, it's like, oh, you're fake. Because that's not how a man should be holding his sword at the same time. Cool. Cool. It's starting to get there. It's getting there. It's like, what, a quarter done or something? Between a quarter and a third? Because that room's not too filled up, but this room... It has a little bit of arts, but look at how many art places there are, too. Look how much paintings you can have in this place. Especially over here. And that music's starting to get annoying. We already know we need two more fossils, and I will try to find those on my own. I just won't turn all of them in. Okay, let's check out the fish. That is one huge crab. That, if I saw that crab and it looked as big as I did, I'd be a little afraid. <laughs> Do your little scared away thing. There are these guys right here. Don't know why they're in their own special tanks though. Hmm. And wait. Oh, and wow, they are on the last part of the side too. I guess maybe they're a rare species or something like that. Although I thought I saw a few skeleton, like skeletal remains of you in the beach whenever I was a kid, since I used to go to the beach a lot when I was a kid, but I don't like the beach, so, uh, yeah. Wow. Look at all the fish. Isn't that amazing? Look at that one. That, look at the flat fish. <laughs> yeah, this looks pretty amazing. It's like, let me turn the 3D on and see what that looks like. <laughs> and then we got the final room of the of this um, water creatures, which uh, this is not. A saltwater exhibit, man. But yeah, you got saltwater creature creatures in here, anyways. Hey, quit tapping the glass. Don't you know the rules? Not allowed to tap the glass. Can you stop tapping the glass. I'm trying to enjoy the. Enjoy everything. And tap in the glass. So, yeah, that's a lot of um, fish in there. But then when you turn over here, it's like, holy crap, there's even more fish. What is it, feeding time? You can see the frog. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Also, once I get the English version, I should be able to come to this museum, check the information, and yeah. That's pretty much a big reason why I want to complete the museum, is because I want to read all the information that I can learn from. Although I know Blathers says something completely different whenever you uh, bring in the fish and do it separately, so... Yeah, we got a little tiny exhibit right here. That angelfish took forever. That striped black and white one up there. <laughs> okay, so... We got all that. We got all those fish and underwater sea creatures done. 
Let's check on the bugs, shall we? The bugs that exhibit looks rather interesting. I will say that. Plus, he can get bit by a stupid mosquito in here. Man. See, I thought I didn't have you. Because in another room, there's an empty thing. There's not an empty one here. I see something. I see a ladybug. That's what I see right there. You can see the diving beetle there. The pond skater. Yeah, look. There's that hard dragonfly. Wait, was that the dragonfly? Maybe that isn't the dragonfly. That took me forever to find. All the butterflies, too. Mm -hmm. Let's just run so they all get up. <laughs> now I got a butterfly room! That red and blue one sure goes fast. Oh. Honeybee. No, I don't want to be near you. I don't like bees. Where's the snail? Maybe it's in the next room. Okay, so we got that room done. Yeah, you can hear the mosquito. There's the mosquito right there, which... Yeah, if you get... Wait. If you wait... Annoying, stupid mosquito. Here it comes. Here it comes. Do it! Just... You weren't even touching me! That don't even make sense! It was at the other side... Whatever. It's probably gonna bite me again. Tch. There's that dragonfly that took... Isn't that... Th yeah, that's definitely the dragonfly that took me forever to get, I think. wonder why the monarch is by itself in this room. Whatever. Get me out of this room. I don't like this room because of the stupid mosquito. <laughs> if they took the mosquitoes biting out, I would feel much better. Now this exhibit right here. <laughs> Man, those guys are ferocious. Hoppers and crickets. And yeah, that's pretty much it for the museum. You see the flea right there that's jumping everywhere. But yeah, that's that's the museum right there. Kind of interesting. It'll be even more interesting when I can actually read the information about it and stuff. It's like the learning area of Animal Crossing right here, where it talks about all, the, like, everything about it and stuff. Nice little interesting touch for the game, but at the same time, I feel good about completing what the... Okay, I don't know what happened there. Um, nice little interesting touch with the game before I forget maybe I should uh maybe I should get a fruit in actually no I don't have well I do have fruit but I need to save them I know what I can do I can buy from Tom Nook 
for from a knuckling and get my 1500 Yeah, get my 1,000 bell, uh, fruit, whatever that is. I have no idea what it is. I think they described it in Japanese as oyster, but that ain't no oyster. <laughs> also, give me some, give me some fertilizer. Huh? Yeah! I got a gold shovel now! It's not like I planned that or anything. You're not buying it, are you? Fine! I kind of reset it when I got to that, which... Now I got a gold shovel. So now I only need one more gold tool. I need the watering can. Which is for the perfect town, which I will be starting probably next video. Because this video has been going on for a while. With all its different, uh... That is very interesting. With all its different, um... Fish and all that. And just showing off the museum. And, as you can tell, nothing's changed. Also, you like my Gracie gear, my leather vest and leather pants combo with Santa boots. <laughs> and then the Minda mask just kind of, uh, kind of just, uh, formulates the whole thing, too. Because it kind of does go with the whole entire outfit. <laughs> Got that on a sale. Um, which is sale is going to be happening in, uh, what? Today, today's the 12th. It starts on the 15th. So, yeah, be sure to tune in for that 15th. That 15th video. Okay, let's, uh... really close to getting the museum done. I keep thinking about it, and it's like, I'm th that, that close. All I gotta do is, uh, all I gotta do is just get the fossils, and, uh, then the paintings. The paintings are the tough part. I remember the paintings being tough in the original game. Yes, I got a food. It cost me a thousand bells. You owe me a thousand bells. What? You're not gonna pay me back? You're gonna give me a reaction instead? Fine. <laughs> yeah, there goes a thousand bells. Is that my reaction? Okay. Show me my reaction. Is it the nod? Oh, is it the bashful? Is it the light bulb? I don't know. <laughs> you don't tell me these things. What the heck? I hope he did not just proclaim love to my character. Yeah, this is me right now. Ugh. 
freaking proclaiming love to a male character when he's a male himself. Okay. You know what I wonder? When I visit my town... Or when I visit this town with my English uh, game... Um, yeah, if that's gonna be Club 444 or Club LOL. LOL. <laughs> Probably Club LOL. It's just gonna look different in the Japanese version than the US version. Also, I'm not sure if I should do this when it comes out. I have not looked at anything with the Dream House. Like, this one Dream Town. I have just know the number to the dream town, but I've never, I have not actually seen what this town looks like, but apparently it's supposed to be some spooky town. What was it? Ica Village or something? And I'm kind of wanting to wait until the English version gets released, but at the same time, I'm kind of hesitant on whether I should wait or go and do it now just to check it out and then check it out again in English. Once I get the dream house, because that really kind of is interesting me a little bit. Surprised no one said anything about it, actually. Because, <laughs> yeah, I know it's been uh, on one YouTuber or two YouTubers. It's It was a big hit, but yeah. Like, oh my god. And all that. But, I mean, I can check it out if you all want me to. Before the ink. English version comes out. Um, yeah, you want me to tell you what I did not know until looking it up? You see these? You see these? These are peaches. Yeah. I did not know if you, like, put them together, they become a basket, and you can hold up to nine at the same time. And I felt like a complete idiot when I figured that or found that out. <laughs> so, yeah, I got uh, nine peaches, nine um, persons, nine mangoes, nine uh, uh, perfect peaches, nine lemons, nine oranges, and three... I forget what those are. <laughs> So I can start planning with that. But then I also got a gold shovel. Oh, what? Oh, the things I can do with a gold shovel. Can plant some money trees now. Okay. But I will start doing that next time because, uh... It's already been, like, what? Pretty much 30 minutes? I just want to check out, uh... What's in the shop. And then I will try to clean up town at the same time with all those presents and silver slingshots everywhere. Ooh, look at the old telephone booth. Today? Sure, why not? I think that's good. Is that like something from the hospital? Okay, so, yeah, I think I'm done recording for tonight. I'm tired. I only had, like, four hours of sleep or something, and I'm just gonna relax and start uh, rendering this video out, and uh, I'll start getting back into the things uh, tonight. Like, as in, uh, when this video goes up, it should be Monday. So, I should be recording this, starting to get back in the... Oh, are you kidding me? I don't have my so my slingshot. I only got a shovel. I can't grow... I can't make trees grow quickly with this. Oh, well, it's not like I got enough presents as it is. And, by the way, that beehive I ran away from, so... Yeah, you don't have to uh, uh, laugh at me at that. Because the, cause the shop was open right here. Yeah. And the next video, I will probably do some updates and stuff. Because, uh... 
what can I talk about while planning stuff, pretty much, because you saw all those, and I'll try to make the best perfect town as I can, and make it last for 14 days with the 15th day getting it. Because I know once you get a perfect town, if you get a perfect town, besides the Jacob's Ladder, if you go to the, uh, if you go to the town hall, you will get, uh, you will get a public work that says you can change the look of the city hall, which you've seen the look change before. And, uh, only way to do that is if you have a perfect town. So, I'll just be looking at that. So, yeah. Um, with that, hope you all enjoyed. And I'll catch you all next time. And I see that it's 626. If you don't get the reference to what 626 is, uh... It's one of my favorite characters. I'm staring right at him. <laughs> um, so, yeah, with that, have a great day, and I'll catch you all next time.